Hi there, this is Martin Hoxie from the Just Regional Support Centre Scotland North and East. Uh, in this video I'll be demonstrating how you could use a free web service called TalkBox for delivering video feedback to students. Now as I mentioned in my uh, blog post, uh, to do this you essentially need to turn your desktop into a, a webcam. And a piece of software I've found to do that is called ManyCams, so you can see it running here in the taskbar. And what you need to do is specify the video source. Uh, in this particular case, I've uh, gone for desktop. Um, one of the features of the ManyCan software is actually you could um, start merging different feeds so you'd be able to include your desktop and potentially if you have a webcam as well. But I'm just going to stick to the desktop. Um, I found using a partial desktop is best. What that basically means is the action is following the cursor um, because uh, TalkBox is using a, a smaller screen um, for the webcam input there's a, a limit to the amount you can show at one time so this keeps a reasonable size um, one of the things I've discovered with many cams is there is this quite annoying uh, logo that appears but uh, it's quite easy to switch that off so you just click a button there, there it's gone. So that just runs in the background. So let's have a look at the top box site itself. It's very easy to register, very straightforward, usual sort of registration process. Uh, there's various options down the left hand side. Uh, we're going to look at video mail just right now. Don't be put off um, by the fact that the uh, image appears to be um, mirrored. Um, you'll find that once you start going into uh, a Word document it's the right way around. So uh, if we just click on record message. This is when you kind of take a leap of faith because you're now presuming that top box is running happily in the background. If you had a, a larger desktop or a dual display it would be easy for you to um, have the top box preview window in one desktop and uh, actually working through the document with the other so you can make sure that what you're doing is visible to the student. Um, similar, very straightforward idea um, of just going through the document, highlighting bits and pieces to the student. Uh, you can highlight um, sentences, you can you know um, reinforce any particular comments that you've got. And then when you go back to the top box site, you just click on stop. And that will start uploading the message to the top so you see there's um, a couple of options here for me now. I can send, I can either play back the message I've recorded or uh, I can use, choose to re-record it all, all together. I'm just going to go to send. Um, in the two fields you can choose to either send it to an individual email address or you can send it to a list of email addresses. So you might use that if the particular essay you, you're providing video feedback on is maybe a model answer for our students to see as well. So I'm just going to put an email address in there as an option for uh, a message as well and I just click on the send. So that's the message sent. If I have a look in my message in there, um, so the student would then just copy this link. And then you can see um, it's now playing the video. And it's a reasonable quality, you know, you can read the text. Um, so that's that part. And another option within here is actually, instead of doing a video mail, is to do live feedback. So there's an option for a conference. Um, it's a similar sort of idea. You have the preview window here. You even have a chat window as well. Um, to invite people to um, view the feedback session there's an option there to share the URL. Now the really impressive um, feature of um, TalkBox is the ability to actually embed um, the TalkBox um, service within, within your own website. Um, so you can, some very basic options here for you to choose. You can decide to add chat window and then you just click on 
uh, to my site now you see that they've got a number of existing social network sites um, so clicking on one of these um, it will ask you for the um, account details for that and it'll give you a bit of code it also has a, a bit of um, code that allows you to embed it into virtually any website um, I've done it into my my blog site you see and again you've got the preview window and you can invite people by sharing the URL so there you go that's Talkbox I think it's a, a very powerful service um, and be very interested to hear um, how if people actually use it and if they find it useful thanks very much bye